So I want to, would love to hear from, can you hear me okay? Yeah. I'd love to hear from all three of you at some point if you want, but uh, maybe we'll start with you, Alex. I'd love to just hear a little bit about how long Colorway's been around and how you guys came together given that you've had uh, multiple uh, bands throughout the years and sure. just hear a little bit about how you came into this. Well, um, I've been making music in the Pioneer Valley for 25 years, since 91 when I moved here, and was with the Drunk Stuntmen. Before that, they were called Soup, and in between that, they were called Quahog. Long story. <laughs> but I uh, was with them until about nine years ago. And um, in 2012, I decided to put a band together of my own stuff. I had had a lot of dreams with melodies coming to me, and I'd wake up and I'd have to put them somewhere. And I put them on my phone, and those would turn into songs eventually. And I said, I have to make these songs, I have to put these songs out there. So uh, I called up a couple of old people, uh, people that I knew, uh, um, we're not old. I'm, you know, <laughs> called up a couple of old people, although that does segue into the Young and Hard Chorus, which I also play with. But J.J. Uh, O'Connell and Dave Hayes, which they are one year older than me, so they are a little bit older. But um, they, I played with J.J. over the years in Drunk Stuntmen, on and off. And I played with Dave a few times, and got together with them, put out a couple records, and they ended up having to do other things. And I ended up having to find um, Two, two more people who wanted to make music as bad as I did. And uh, I found Matt, I found Riley, and, uh, and here we are. We've been playing together as a group. We played our first show as the three of us a year ago this past September. And uh, it's, been a, it's been a great year and a half. We opened up for Foreigner at the Calvin and the Yardbirds and Green River Festival. It's been nuts. It's been busy, busy, busy. Be careful what you wish for. So it's been a good, it's been a good uh, year and a half. So here, and here we are. In the advocate. That's great. Yeah. And Under the grow lamps. Under the grow lamps. <laughs> Where are yeah. your 12? Where are the 12? It's, a, it's like a, a I spy. You can take a look around and try to see it yourself. Uh, would either of you or, or both like to share a little bit about how you came into the band? Uh, if it's a, a sound you were familiar with from past bands that you've been in or, or what have you? Uh, just what it's been like to come in? Yeah, uh, yeah I, I saw Alex first play at an XTC cover night at the Iron Horse and um, I heard him sing and I really liked his voice, I liked his style of playing, and, uh, and so I, I kept track of what he was doing in the valley and um, he released a couple of videos after that with the old color way, and, um, and then he ended up contacting me to see if I was available, and um, I actually don't know, Alex, what, how did you find out about me? Reed Sutherland from Mammal Bath. Uh, no, Reese, Reese, what's his last name? Reese. What is it? Williams. Reese Williams. I wrote him. He suggested that I talk to you, and you suggested that I talk to you. You said that you were way too busy to do any of this, and now here we are. <laughs> well, here we are is the most important thing. Ready to rock. Great. Any thoughts on what it's been like to get involved, Matt? Yeah, it's been pretty different. I've never really played in a uh, rock band, and I often play in bands that are a lot bigger with seven, eight, nine. 10 people, so it's, it's been a challenge and a good growing experience to be more exposed. So are you guys uh, tonight playing songs that you've written and then you guys came into having come into the band more recently, or do you anticipate that? We're uh, going to do uh, four tunes. The first two songs are brand new, Great. and they're the first songs that we have put together as a group, the three of us. And uh, the, the second two songs we're going to do are off of the most recent album called the Black Sky Sequence. Oh, and, um, and, uh, and yeah, and so these guys both are in Shafa Zoba, so that's how the nine-piece band comes about. And uh, it's, it's the difference between, I've never played in a nine-piece band, but I can only imagine that going from nine-piece to three-piece is a bit different. So I applaud these guys for, for doing this, because uh, it's just us, you know? It's uh, putting that out there, putting it out there in this, nothing to hide behind, so this is a, it's a pretty intense experience for, for all involved. That's great. Yeah. We're really thrilled to have you here. Thank well, you guys. Thank so, you for uh, asking us. Yeah, the floor is yours. Have an awesome time, and uh, one more round of applause. Thanks. Yeah. 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 Thanks, everybody, for being here. This is a real treat. Thank you for showing up.